what more does Marlene Dietrich have to do to get applause? No, 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 don't bother. Too little and too late. <laughs> What's the news across the nation? <laughs> We have got the information on the way. We hope we'll amuse yous. <laughs> the plunger chair. <laughs> I just love to give you my view. Cook piano player. <laughs> la 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 la. Ladies and gentlemen, loving looks at. Ah, but enough about this. <laughs> Owen and Martin. Time for the six o'clock news, brought to you every night at 12.30 with Dan Rowan and Dick Martin and Melvin Laird in government, Howard Hughes in business, Henry Ford in management, Mia Farrow in labor. And now, here's Dick Martin. Good evening, I'm away on vacation tonight, so I'll be filling in for Dan Rowan, who is on special assignment someplace else, and now, here's the news. Hollywood, California, a new sports record was set today during the star-studded Hollywood celebrity baseball game. It occurred in the fourth inning when Danny Thomas swung at an inside pitch and drove his nose 400 feet into the left field seats. I don't like to hear that. Uh, news of the future 20 years from now. After 20 years in the making, Congress today finally passed legislation granting equal rights for the blacks and the Indians. Under the new law, every black is treated the same as every Indian. <laughs> America was saddened when its first marriage between two men ended today after a five stormy years. The action required an unusual application of the California divorce law when Mr. Tebbett sued Mr. Tebbett charging irreconcilable similarities. <laughs> Those guys couldn't get along. Well, that's... Yeah. The news of the future, another item from the future, Washington, D.C., 20 years from now. Outgoing chief of the FBI, J. Edgar Hoover, announced completion of his long-awaited book, Everything You've Always Wanted to Know About Everybody But Were Afraid to Find Out. For rights to the book, Mr. Hoover's asking $25 million, or else he'll have it published. Here's what's happening on the Hollywood scene. Hi, friends. Busy, buzzy, buzzing around Tinseltown, and have I got a hot item for you. <laughs> Richard Burton was seen in an intimate, secluded restaurant with this glamorous movie star. <laughs> Insiders say that it's uh, more than a <laughs> friendship. <laughs> Remember, friends, you heard it first from Busy Buzzy. <laughs> kissy, kissy. <laughs> Our editorial subject tonight is divorce. Statistics show that one out of every three marriages ends in divorce. It should be obvious to everyone that we've got to stop this high rate of divorce. Anyone wishing to rebut this may do so I disagree. By... A little known fact is that the main cause of divorce is marriage. Now, if we can abolish marriage, the divorce rate would begin to decline. Well, if you're gonna hit me with logic, forget it. <laughs> For our sports expert, come in, Big Al. Hi, guys. Big Al here. Oh, I love that bad. Well, the final score tonight is Dave Clark 5, the Brothers 4, Chicago 7, Indianapolis 500, Premier 2, and Don DeFore. <laughs> Oh. Da, da, de, da. Ladies and gents, laughing looked at the news, and I can't tell you how sorry I am. Ach, 
Kein Knopf ist das Mädel wert, das Schuten flutsches Opfer